level. Rank. Hi, I'm Mew and I'm plus size. I'm on a mission to try traditionally straight size brands and see if they work with my plus size body. I've already tried House of CB and that was, it was interesting, you can watch that here. I've also tried Zara and that place had a few surprises actually. You can watch that here. Today, I'm trying Urban Outfitters. <laughs> okay. Urban Outfitters, what do I know about this brand? Well, I know that I haven't shopped there since I was a student, which was years ago. Um, and that's when I was like a UK 14. So I was much smaller than I am now, but still big in terms of Urban Outfitters. I only ever go in now to look at their homeware. I really like their bath mats. <laughs> I like their cocktail glasses. I love their trinkets. As you can tell, I'm a trinket girl lee um so yeah love a trinket me what else do i know i feel like they're a very gen z brand very gen z focused in my mind it's very much for slender girlies and the cool guys because they it looks it, you're like in my mind i'm like you're cool but it definitely has that like shabby chic vibe it's like it's trying to be vintage but with a hundred pound price tags you know <laughs> so weird so urban outfitters that is where we're gonna we're gonna try today we are very brave okay before we go shopping i think it's worth looking at what they have going on online on their social media on their website so oh without further ado adieu 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 we're in and i actually logged in today so we can actually scroll a bit more Ooh, nine million followers i can see that they're heavily leading into um freshers week because it's freshers week in the uk or freshers month it's towards the end of it so it's all about students student offers everyone looks very youthful oh my goodness wow i'm seeing a plus size a plus size person in the top nine this is promising. This is promising. They are wearing a very simple outfit, but still, I'm really, you know, it's a good move. Oh my God, the Brat merch, it's like, it's very fun. It's very vibrant, very demure. It's really cool. They have like gigs and stuff, like Urban Outfit is Alive. Um, in America, not over here, <laughs> but still very cool. Yeah, I actually really dig their socials. I think the direction is really like easy breezy. It's very chill, it's very cool. It's like cool, but accessible. Uh, but yeah, it is very young. It is not. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's like for my age group, but the more I scroll, like the less like body diversity I'm seeing, I'm sure I'll be surprised at one sec. Yeah? Okay, we've got a plus size girly who's an Urban Outfitters partner, sponsored. Yes, fatty's getting the check. I say that with love, okay, as a fatty. Yes, queen. Oh, she's, she's eating that up. Yeah, you know what? I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I don't know what I was expecting, but for some reason I just had a negative. <laughs> yeah, she's been through a lot. It's a trauma. It's a trauma for me. I'm actually really happy in terms of like race diversity. There's a bit of body type. It's not like massive, but it's like enough. Okay, we've had a look at their socials. I think now we should have a look at their website. Put your money where your mouth is, Urban Outfitters. Let's see if you, you're really about this. Except all cookies, of course. They have a massive sale on at the moment and they, they really want you to know about it. Okay, scrolling, cute brands and so I'm not really seeing much diversity up top. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? People of colour. Check. Body diversity. Mm, she doesn't go here. So I'm going to go to women's and see what's new. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, they sell Gap. Who knew? Quicksilver. They've got a lot of brands. They've got a lot of, like, brands. I was going to say cool brands, but the Gap. <laughs> Please. Cute. Cute. Oh, my God. I love this Spider-Man top. I'm such, like, a little, little nerd. Like, give me that Marvel. Give it to me. Yeah, still, in terms of body diversity, she doesn't go here. Um, on the website, ooh, they've got, they've got Korean beauty, damn. Okay, up and out first, I didn't know you were about that. Oh my God, these socks, live, laugh, love frogs. <laughs> yeah, you know what, we can, we can, we can stop, we can stop. I feel like I've seen, she's seen enough. <laughs> yeah, that was like, that was like insightful. I feel like I learned more about Urban Outfits as a brand. I still don't feel like they want my coin, I feel like, they're happy to use plus size content creators or influencers on their socials, but they still got a way to go on their actual website. And that's where most people are doing the shopping. Yes, you go on 
their socials to be inspired and to see what's new but then you also go on the website because that's where you're going to do the shopping so you know minus in store it really feels like urban outfitters is very much like it's very gen z okay which i'm not you thought it was <laughs> fair um fair so we're gonna go to urban outfitters in manchester the one in manchester is huge there are so many floors there are so many clothes and i feel like i've got a good chance of finding something maybe something today i mainly want xl xl xxl if they exist in urban outfitters because okay this is what plus size girlies plus size people we want to see what the fit is like but yeah i'm excited for this one i think i'm also very nervous so with no further ado let's go it's shopping time. I actually do love their um, printed shirts. Kind of cute guys. But this is the men's size, so I need to turn around. Oh my god. Is that makeup this way? <laughs> kind of obsessed. <laughs> Wait, how much are they? I'm good. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I have always wanted one of these. You know, I like one of these. 35. Okay, I found an extra large, we'll try it. I'm staying away from the motel stuff. Uh, it's given athleisure, it's not very much, so up we go. How Spice Girls is this? <laughs> British Invasion. This is where clothes um, come to, you know? I've seen some bits that look interesting, like this. Let's see what else we can find. It's given corporate body, it's given business casual in the club. <laughs> Love the colours of this. How cute. Being up here feels like a reward. You've, you've gone through all the other stuff downstairs, but... More sale. I don't think I have the energy to like trawl through <laughs> all those clothes though. We have a lot, so let's go try them on. Hey guys, okay, we're in the changing rooms. We're ready to get into these outfits. First top is this cute little vest top with a nice little slogan. I really like the color and the fit. She's really cute and Next, this red dress, which I think is really cute. It's an XL and yeah, trying it on. Uh, we're getting it on, it fits. Oh my gosh. Um, I actually don't really like how this looks on my body. I think it just highlights my stomach in not a fun way, but yeah, I can groove in it. I can move in it. The color looks really nice against my skin. And of course I'm gonna 360 in this dress. But yeah, oh, <laughs> what do you guys think? It's fine. Next, we have this really cute cream top with a nice little bow moment. I think the shape of this top is not my favorite. And of course I'm wearing the wrong bra with it. It's given coquette, you know, she's being a little bit demure. Um, it is cute, but it's not that good. What do you think? Okay, we have this dress and oh no guys, it's a motel dress. Remember what I said earlier? 
I'm staying away from the motel still. But it's got some stretch. I'm not saying I'm hopeful, but we're gonna give it a good go. And I love the skirt material, it's quite linen-y. If that, that's a word, that's not really a word. But um, guys, I am getting this dress on my body and I absolutely love her. I just think this is so cute. I just, I can see myself, oh, it is very short in the back guys, it is. But oh my goodness, I, even with it being really short, I could wear some shorts or something. I could wear some like, little leggings or something. I think it's so cute. I love that I can move in it. It fits my body really nicely. Guys, I'm genuinely, genuinely surprised. Now time for this floaty skater blue dress. It looks really cute. It gets on very easily and guys, I look so good. Pull the lever, crunk. Okay, I look really cute. I think it works really nicely on my body. It's really flowy and perfect for a holiday I have coming up. Love it. Next, another blue dress, which looks okay. Yeah, I'm still obsessed with this one. Okay, moving on, Mew. Okay, try it on this blue dress. It's got some stretch, which is good. And she's on. Guys, this has been so successful. She's on. I don't really love the cup situation and it is hella short in the back, not a vibe. Yeah, that shortness is not really cool. Don't like the cups, not for me. Next, I don't really know why I picked up this top. I just like shiny things. And guys, the fit was so awkward and weird. <laughs> it's not for me. But to go alongside it, I thought let's pick up this denim mini skirt that will definitely fit my body. Where I'm zipping, where I'm getting it, it's on one leg. It's only on one leg. But I can see the vision. I can see how cute this would be if it fit. Why do I have another mini skirt? What is wrong with me, guys? But you know what? We're gonna loosen this skirt up. We're gonna make sure it's got some stretch and we're getting it on my body. I mean, huh? she's on. <laughs> it's giving white chicks. Yeah, this is a no. This is definitely the delusional section of the video because why is this topper small and why am I trying it on? I mean, it's on. Okay, emo queen, the appropriate top to try was this corsetti top, but the cups were wrong, it did not work. Next, we've got this red dress, which is really cute, very 90s, got some stretch, it's got some burnt velvet going on. It's it's cute, but yeah, another dodgy cup situation, not really for me. So yeah, another flop. It's our final item. It's this cute black dress. It's a skater skirt. We're praying to a fashion god. I love the lace detailing on the hem, but guys, I am already stuck. I am already, I can't get my arm through. Um, So I'm not feeling particularly hopeful for this dress. It is painful. I'm losing hope. I'm, oh, she's on, okay. But I didn't like suffering, so. Wow, guys, we tried on all of these clothes. I can't believe it. I didn't know Urban Outfitters, we would have any success as a plus size girl. Just wanna say thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you. Give me a like, give me a thumbs up, subscribe. And if you support me, maybe I'll go back and get these two dresses.